Candyman. 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 <laughs> I can't do the last one. Hey there, Parker Reed here, and welcome to Pete. Our media, your home for everything movies and music, through my eyes. And today we have a review of the brand new 4K Ultra HD Blu ray edition of the 2021 version of Candyman. Ah, oh, shit, that's five times. For decades, the housing projects of Chicago's Cabrini Green were terrorized by a ghost story about a supernatural hook handed killer. In present day, an artist begins to explore the macabre history of Candyman, not knowing it would unravel his sanity and unleash a terrifying wave of violence that puts him on a collision course with destiny. Going into this review, I've seen Candyman one other time. I saw it in theaters earlier this year, and I wasn't that crazy about it. There are a lot of really relevant themes in this movie, but they're presented in such a heavy-handed, obvious way that it makes the audience seem dumb. It's not subtle at all. It's very heavy-handed. They even address that in the movie, but that's not an excuse, and that doesn't make it okay. It's just not my favorite movie. I think it is creepy in parts, but albeit it's not nearly as scary as the original. Now, while there are good sequences in this movie, it's a bit too short, and overall, Overall, it left me feeling pretty unsatisfied. So I wouldn't really recommend the movie, but would I recommend this 4K transfer? Let's find out. If you decide to pick up Candyman on 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray in the United States, there's only one version to pick from, and is the standard edition slipcover you see right here. And on the cover, it has the standard poster art seen on a lot of the posters leading up to the movie's release. And on the back, we have some information about the film, its technical specs, as well as what special features are offered. Here is what the spine looks like. And when you take off the slipcover, the case itself looks exactly the same as its slipcover counterpart. And on the inside, we have a Blu-ray disc on the left and that 4K disc on the right. For visuals on Candyman, we have upscaled 4K, and this is in widescreen, so you will have black bars at the top and the bottom. And overall, this movie looks great, but there are a few problems with the HDR. Just to start things off here, this movie is beautiful. The cinematography on it is fantastic, and there is a lot of detail that comes with this. There's really no grain in this movie, and this is one of the best looking horror movies as just as far as detail goes that I've seen in quite a long time. But the problem for me here is the HDR and the cinematography. I'm not sure which is more to blame, because this movie is very dark and unnaturally dark. And they'll be in wide open spaces with sunlight, and there'll be very intense shadows on their faces. It just doesn't make any sense. It's almost like they let the camera guy in the shot and he's just creating shadows on the lead actor's faces. So that was a bit distracting and during some of the darker scenes it is a bit hard to make out what's going on. I wanted a little bit more of that detail in those scenes but overall there's a lot of detail here and it doesn't feel like an upscale title to me albeit some of the CGI especially towards the last five minutes is a bit rough. For audio on Candyman we have Dolby Atmos and it's fantastic. This Dolby Atmos track is fantastic. The score on Candyman is pretty eclectic and I did enjoy it throughout. You can always hear the dialogue and overall this is a great sounding mix. It is a bit loud so you will have to turn down your speakers a little bit if you, unless you want to piss off your neighbors. But once you get past that it is a good sounding mix and overall this Dolby Atmos track does its job really well. So would I recommend Candyman on 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray? I'm going to have to say yes. This is a Wait for a sale item. I don't think this is worth full price by any means. Don't pay 25 or 30 bucks for this. This will be 15, 10 bucks in the next six months to a year. So wait for that or catch it on streaming because I don't think this movie is that special. And I think this transfer, while good, is not going to be reference quality or anything like that. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked what you saw here, you can check us out on Facebook or Instagram and like, comment, and subscribe if you so choose. My name is Parker Reed. You've been watching P. R. Media. Keep supporting physical media, and I'll see you next time. Thanks, guys. I think I made a mistake. No! I brought him back. Candyman isn't real. He chose you. He has purpose for you. Tell everyone. <laughs> New to the neighborhood. <laughs> you should say it. Candyman. Say his name.